wish Ashley was here, but Giselle, Ashley, and Sharice, we had a nice little get together. And I was thinking about some of the things that were said. You know, Giselle, you were very adamant on Juan can't be around his coworker slash friend because of the optics. No, 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 let me just In talk. public. In, in public, in, in, all of that. Yes. Right, and, and I'm not gonna ask him to do anything differently that he would not normally do outside of my knowledge. Did I say that? Or he said that? He can't be seen with her? No, I said what I said. We... No, 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 she wanted me almost to be upset with him because I'm being dragged into this situation where the public is just speculating. Okay. And what I'm saying is, okay. I don't care that the block is hot. I feel like the two of them are like Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> <laughs> It's really refreshing to see Giselle be real with her friends. I feel sorry for the people who waste their precious time mm -hmm. worrying about my boring okay. life. So all right, thank you, you for the you. update. Yeah. Have we handled all of that? Because I said to Karen that she owes you an apology. Yeah. And, and then, I said to Giselle, you owe me an apology. So I, I don't think you can move forward without talking if you are open to it. And I'm good. Okay. So let's go have a moment. Come okay. on. OK. Oh. <laughs> So did you guys see the house? How is it? Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. It's really pretty, yeah. Thank you. It's very I'm like proud of Ashley. It's very uh, country chic. Yeah. No, she said. But it, no, not said, country. It's peachy. Where you been? Yeah. Oh, I've been talking to the doctor. Yeah. We had a really good conversation, Wendy and I. Oh, good. Have a seat, Miss Robin. We're gonna all sit right. by each other. <laughs> okay. I mean. All right. Look. First of all, yeah. get your breath on the food. Uh, well. You and I have been not the closest of friends in this circle for years. Yeah. But last year, it went extremely left. One day, people are going to see you for who you are. People see me right now, and they get yeah, really a bull. Off. I know that you know about the rumors about the blonde girl in Georgetown. I know you know that because you're smart. All I've of us know about it, right? Never heard of it in my life. But what you should care about, Karen, is people sending us actual pictures of you with a blue-eyed man in Redskins gear in Vegas at a bar. OK. What I care about is how Robin Dixon and Karen Huger decide to move on. To set boundaries, I think that, for me, I won't repeat rumors about you. I will only repeat facts about you. I want you to do the same thing. Same thing. Wendy, Karen told us that you might be doing a new show. Yeah. Oh, really? So you guys know I've been in the political commentator space for a long time. And I came to a point, especially during the pandemic, where I felt like the news sometimes shies away from topics that they think are too controversial. Well, everything ain't for everybody. Everything nope. ain't for everybody. My demographic is a little bit different. The educational demographic of my shows. That's it's probably going to go over my head. My show vibrates really high, so if people are not at an intellectual level to receive it, not understand why it may not be for them. That's a little shady. Was it? I was just drinking my water. You know, she already made it very clear that she said she doesn't want to me, so... If somebody threw a drink on you, would you? I'm not in town for business. Oh, oh, no, no, no. I need to know something. Your marriage, is it open or is it traditional? We have a traditional marriage. Okay. We do not have an open marriage. And you're married legally. Yes. All right. That's all I need to know. Can I expect the same from you, though, as far as how we deal with each other? Um, I mean, you started it. That's all I can no, say. No, I did not start you it. You did. No, no, you started it. No. We'll never agree. You started it. People you saw started. you as a liar, not me. Let's go. They, you did it. You did it. Trust. You did. Listen, the, the, the moral to this story is don't talk about me, and I won't talk about you. The end. I'm not trying to play the lawyer card, but let's get some order going on here. I think that, first of all, it's not just about throwing a drink, but after we wrapped in New York and everyone said their piece, you then go on social media and then proceed to attack me. So let's not throw rocks and hide our hands here. But the, And you can't talk about women's empowerment when the moment you get a chance to beat someone down, you beat them down. Why not uplift me, Wendy? Because you're slow, I can't uplift you. You're too low down. <laughs> If you vibrate so high, why are you so quick to call somebody so slow? And because you're slow. She likes in her mind thinks that she's going high, but she's really going low, okay? Wendy comes at people with these nasty phrases because it's her way of making herself feel better about herself. I am 
such in a good place. Like, love your energy, love yours, love yours. Excited about my show. Let's elevate the conversation. Hey, what, are we staying outside? No, we'll just grab a beverage and go inside. All right, I'm going inside. 